Hello everyone, it is afternoon again. Gosh, I can't catch you guys in the mornings. It's just too crazy around here. I'm pulling out the camera because today's the big day. Today we have Grayson's fifth birthday party. He's turning five. His birthday isn't actually until Tuesday the 11th. We're having it today on the 8th, just because it works best with everybody's schedules. <clears throat> everybody's kind of in town for Easter anyway, which is tomorrow. So we're just getting it out of the way. So Anthony and I have been busy this morning. We've been putting up decorations, blowing up balloons, trying to get everything ready. Um, Anthony is actually at Grayson's soccer game. It's the first soccer game of the season. I stayed back home so that Porter could take a nap. Avery's sleeping too, and then I can keep cleaning and getting ready for this party. So I'm bummed to be missing it. I don't think I've ever missed a soccer game. I don't feel like I have. And so it's kind of sad that I'm not there and like for the first game of the season, but that's okay. Anthony's there. He said Gray's trying to score all the goals that he can. Um, Anthony's grandparents are here. They're visiting from Georgia. So they're just here for the day. So they're at the Grayson soccer game as well. And then they're gonna be here for the party. And then all my siblings are coming and my parents and my grandparents are coming to the party. So it's gonna be fun. And I'll just show you guys what we have going on. So Grayson's party is PJ mask theme. Um, if you don't know what that is, it's a kid show. Look it up. Um, I don't know if it's on Nick or Cartoon Network, I have no idea. But anyway, I just got like a party pack off of Amazon and so it came with all these like tin foil um, PJ mask balloons. So we just have them kind of hanging everywhere. And then I went and got a helium tank so we could just blow them up here. And the helium tank came with like regular balloons. So we just picked out blue, red, and green because that's what like the main characters are. One's blue, one's red, one's green. Um, so they came with these cute little like characters so we put those on the wall just for like decoration i don't know <laughs> and then we've got this tablecloth that has pj masks on it cups plates napkins we actually got two tablecloths so we don't even need that other one and then it came with a banner so i hung that up and then we've got some birthday presents right here started my mom went and wrapped them in spider-man um, wrapping paper which is super cute gray has been wanting to open them actually it's really been porter who's been wanting to open all the presents so we have some gifts anthony and i are going to wait to give gray all of our presents until his actual birthday so he has stuff to open up on his birthday but i am giving him one of our gifts today because it's a bunch of pj mask superhero capes with little matching like eye masks so I thought it'd be cute for him to wear at his PJ Masks birthday party so we are giving him one of those early. Miss Avery is here snoozing. Anthony's grandma was holding her for the longest time and then they had to go to the soccer game so she's been snoozing while I've been running around trying to clean. I just finished cleaning the hardwood floor but I'm gonna have to feed her soon. She's just being such a good baby. My mom got her these cutest little outfits. They're from Caden Lane. I've seen ads for them on Instagram. They are so cute. They're one of those slip knot outfits. You just tie it at the bottom and then it's easy to get to their diapers and change and all that. And they come with the cutest little bows. So I had her get all dressed up for the party. She's meeting, well, she already met Anthony's grandparents for the first time, and then she's gonna meet my grandparents for the first time. So I had to get her in something cute, and of course, a bow. So anyway, Porter's napping, like I said, and we're just um, getting everything ready. My mom's picking up cake and Chick-fil-A. That's the food we're gonna have. And then I just have like a bunch of chips, so I'm gonna get those out in bowls. And not pour them out yet, because I don't want them to get stale, but just get it all ready. My moms are honestly helping me out the most by picking up the cake and the food because I feel like that's what usually takes up most of my time on birthday party days is just running around trying to pick everything up that I need. If you remember last year for Grayson's fourth birthday, I went and to a professional cake baker. It was like a company and I had them make a cake for Grayson. It was like number themed and they spelled his name wrong. If, if you remember, go back and watch that vlog. They spelled his name G R A Y S O N and he's G R E Y. So I like messaged them, found out the night before the party had to run over so they could fix it the day of the party it was a hot mess so this time i just went to meyer because they had a pj mask cake it was 20 bucks 
usually when I go to these professional cake bakers, they're like 75 to 100 bucks. So this is much cheaper and he's gonna love it all just the same. So hopefully they spell his name right. I, I double checked that they had the right spelling and stuff. So my mom's gonna pick up that cake and all that. And then I've got this cutest little um, cake topper I'm gonna put on the top. And so it'll be super cute. We even have like some PJ Masks characters that I could probably like get out and put on the cake as well. So it's just gonna be low key, but Gray is super pumped about his party. He's been talking about it for days. Porter's very excited as well. So it's just gonna be fun. I said, it's just a low key party and the biggest thing that matters is that Grayson gets attention and has an awesome day. That's all that matters. Not my stress and not baby Avery. But I was telling Anthony, I, know, I wonder who's going to get more attention at this party, Grayson or Avery, <laughs> just because she's new and everybody wants to hold her. So it's going to be fun. I'm a little stressed. It's a little stressful with Anthony's parents or with Anthony's grandparents here, just because like I want to be running around getting everything done and Anthony's kind of like wanting to entertain them and talk to them. We haven't seen them in a while, so it's just a little hard to get it all done, but that's okay. I'm not really trying to impress too many people. It's really just Anthony's grandparents and then my family coming, so it's not too bad. Also, look what Porter did. Yeah, we told him, do not bring the balloons in the living room. And what did he do? He brought it in the living room and then let it go. And it's not close to the banister, so I don't know how we're going to get that balloon. It might just be stuck. I don't know. I'll have to ask Anthony when he comes home if he has any grand ideas. So yeah, that's that's just great. So I got to find <coughs> places for these four balloons here and then I should be good with the balloons. I'm a little nervous. We blew up the balloons early this morning and I didn't even think about it, but like regular balloons just don't stay inflated that long. Like the foil ones probably will, but these regular latex ones, I worry that they're not gonna make it for the party. So I guess we'll see. Anthony said, don't be nervous about it, but I should have wait. I should have had us wait, but we had time this morning. So we we're like, oh, let's just get it done, get it done. So we'll see. We'll see how it turns out. Wish me luck. Yeah, 
that was the fun. Bob looks like Grandma Denzel. Mm. Thank you, Grandma Denzel. She's not here. Like Let's say it to the phone. Thank you, Grandma Denzel. Yay. Yeah. 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 after eight so we're trying to stay awake till nine huh that's why we're nikki nikki girl oh goodness we had an awesome birthday party for grayson anthony's upstairs putting the boys to bed everybody has left but gray had so much fun i hope you guys enjoyed those clips i got of him opening presents and the singing happy birthday as you can see he just loved the attention and happy birthday and the cake they just loved it both the kids loved it so totally ah. worth it oh okay sorry avery was getting grumpy so now i have to walk um but the boys loved it grayson had a great day he got so many presents a lot of lego presents which is just kind of like his age and what he's interested in right now my mom got him a mickey mouse disney castle and he set up almost the whole thing he has like one last part to do so he has been loving that we'll play more with toys tomorrow he did not want to go to bed because he wanted to keep playing with all his toys overall it was an awesome party everybody came i was so excited my sister announced that she is expecting during the party she gave a present to gray and inside it was a shirt that said cousin crew and then it had a little baby onesie that said baby do in october so i'm so excited for her she is 12 weeks long she didn't even let any of us know she kept it a secret how dare she so we were pregnant at the same time i just didn't know it wish we could have taken a picture but that's okay i'm glad she told us when she was ready but i'm so excited another little baby coming soon avery's gonna have a playmate they're gonna be like seven months apart so fun but yeah we had a great day and <laughs> As much as I want to say like, okay, nothing, no, nothing, you know, we can take a break now. Uh, no, we can't because tomorrow's Easter. <laughs> so yeah, kind of a crazy year this year with back-to-back -back birthday party and then Easter, but 
do what you gotta do. So I had the boys set up their Easter baskets. So here they are, Grayson, Porter, and even Avery. My mom got her one so that she would be able to have the Easter bunny come visit her. Although I don't think the Easter bunny's really bringing you anything, Avery. I hope that's okay. <laughs> but uh, yeah, they set them out so the Easter bunny would find them. Also, we have eggs that we're gonna hide around the house for the boys to find as well. Usually I've been sleeping in in the mornings because I'm up all night with the baby, but I think I'm gonna get up with the boys tomorrow, which is gonna be rough for me, but totally worth it so I can watch them find their Easter baskets and find the eggs and all that good stuff. But we had such a good birthday party for Gray. As always, I'm so happy when it's over. I'm happy I did it. And then his real birthday is on Tuesday. So we have a couple more gifts that Anthony and I will give him. And then he will be five, which just blows my mind that we're gonna have a five-year-old. Blows my mind that we have three kids too. It's just time flies. So hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. Um, I will definitely vlog tomorrow with Easter. We're going to do, obviously, like I said, Easter basket, Easter eggs. And then uh, tomorrow after nap time, we're going to go to my mom's house and do Easter dinner there. And we're going to do an Easter egg hunt at my mom's house too. So lots of fun coming tomorrow. It's going to be Avery's first Easter. Ah, I'm so excited. I will definitely pull out the camera, so make sure to stay tuned. But thanks so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Bye. See, bye, Avery. See, I'm not staying awake. Uh oh. Gonna have to change your position. Say good night. See you guys tomorrow for Easter. Say happy Easter.